As part of our Boomtown 2040 series, we're taking a look at growth in Central Texas, and all of that growth is causing an increased demand for transportation. The Cap Metro pickup service in Maynard is expanding after the amount of people riding it quadrupled within six months. KB Steranisha Heron spoke with Travis County's Long Range Planning Director about what they're doing to keep up with all this demand. Deranisha? First, Patrick, let me explain what this pickup service is. It is an on-demand pickup service similar to Uber or Lyft, except this one will only cost you $1.25. You can download their app and call for the bus to pick you up and take you wherever you want to go within a specific geofenced area. Because this service is so popular, Travis County leaders are partnering, partnering with Capital Metro to add a third bus to their inventory to keep up. Travis County's Long Range Planning Director, Shalene Walker, says they started the on-demand pickup service in Maynard in June with 446 passengers. By December, they served over 1,700 passengers that month alone, which caused drivers to get behind on their pickups. Missed the folks that we could get them within 15 minutes of calling for a ride any, from anywhere in that geofence location. And it was taking more than 15 minutes. Sometimes it was taking up to 30 minutes. Sometimes we couldn't go pick them at all because there just wasn't any availability. Travis County is paying for 25% of the cost for the new pickup bus, which is about $25,000. Cap Metro is paying for the rest. And according to the Texas Demographic Center, Maynard is one of the fastest growing cities in Texas, which is why Walker wants to continue to grow their transit system. But that's hard to do with a 3.5% tax cap um, that was implemented by the legislature last year. So how we fund that moving forward is what we're really trying to figure out. They hope to have the third bus in their Mainer service area on the streets by January 21st. This service is also offered at five other locations, which you can find on our website in the studio. Darren Heron.